Hi there, students. A corollary. A corollary. Okay, this is um, something that results from something else. This is the upshot of something. So, um, one of the corollaries of uh, people working at home is a decrease in demand for office space. Yeah, it, this is uh, uh, a result of people working at home. More people working at home means that companies need less space and therefore companies uh, ha uh, rent less space. They have less demand for office space. So this is a natural consequence of something, an effect, a result of it. Let's see. In probably in mathematics or in logic, um, a corollary is um, okay. You have a theory or um, uh, uh, a proposition that you prove. Maybe it's quite co complex to prove. And then a corollary is something else that is easy to show as a result of showing that the first thing is true. Okay, so it's um, something that, uh, it, it, something else it, that is a result of showing that the first thing is true. Okay, so a, co a corollary, um, an argument, a fact that results from something else. Um, so, um, yeah, the uh, government uh, has been cracking down on crime uh, and they've been spending more money on the police. One of the corollaries of this is increased overcrowding in prisons. It's an outcome. It's a, a direct result. Yeah, it's an obvious re uh, deduction. It's a, a natural consequence. Um, okay, so it's something that is very clear uh, from the uh, original from the original proposition. Yeah, something that naturally accompanies something else. Um, okay, the um, the company that was the major employer in a small town went bankrupt, and. Uh, the, there are many corollaries from this initial uh, thing. Um, p house prices went down, unemployment went through the roof. Uh, many many uh, small businesses in the town also went bankrupt. Yeah, so these are things that follow. Yeah, that follow on from uh, the first thing. Yeah, they, they are something that are obviously going to happen as a, as a result. Okay, so a, a natural consequence, a natural result, yeah? An aftermath, a result, um, uh, an upshot of something, a consequence, uh, uh, the, the result of it. Um, so if you learn a foreign language, um, one of the corollaries is the fact that learning another language, a second language, uh, a second foreign language, will be easier. Okay, it's as a corollary of learning the first language, the second, the learning of the second language will become easier. It's just a logical result because you understand better how languages work, how your own language works as well. Okay, so this is quite a formal word. I think I would, what am I going to give it informality? A corollary, 7, 7.5 informality, 7. Use it in a semi-formal conversation, semi-formal or formal writing. Don't use it uh, informally. Um, and then as to origin, okay, there's a, la a late Latin word, corollarium. This is money paid for flowers, or a tip, or a consequence. Yeah, um, it, it's like a sm uh, a small crown, uh, or money paid for 
uh, extra money paid, like a tip, yeah, from Corona, a wreath or a crown. So, enough. If you enjoyed the video, give it a rating. It would be a natural corollary of uh, enjoying the video. Subscribe to my channel. That would be another corollary of uh, enjoying this video. And I will see you soon. Bye for now. Corollary.